harvest be bountiful? Mayhaps. If the rains come not first, they be late already. The Almighty will hold them back. I pray so. Should the rains come, the crop shall rot in the fields, and we shall eat worms for our meals. Come on! Will you walk? Well, I am walking. Forgive me. I speak of naught but floods and famine. I leave you to your greater musings. Work, work, work. It's all I do anymore. Oh, enough, Pierre. Really, come on. Well, you know, it's easy for you to say. You're used to this kind of work. You're working class. What? Oh, look at him. Look at him just watching. If he cared about me, he would do something about it. He cares about you, Pia. Trust me. He's probably the only one who does. Come on, let's unload this. Everyone else gets to pick fruit. How come I'm to my armpits and pig dung? I be the cause of that. You? How are you the cause of that? I asked for you. I faith you'd be good company. Oh, really? Oh, that's very flattering. Next time, did you buy me a beer or something? Blast it! You left the gate open. Ah, oh, no way. I pegged it. Not well enough, I think. I can't but three. One of them slipped away. Oh, come on. Let's go get him. Is that good enough? It is more than good. Now you're near open it. Hey, pick, pick, pick. Come on, pick. It's crossed. I fear we lost it. Yeah, nothing a pigskin gets a better gym stack. Sounds like it's stuck on something. Hang on, buddy. Coming to get you. Jimmy! Jimmy's back! Jimmy! You know, there's something about a fresh shave in the morning that makes a man feel halfway civilized. Civilized enough to get married? Yeah. And to a woman that loves me so much, she tried to kill me. You know what, Ander? I think she plans to finish the job. I don't think so. She had plenty of opportunity. Oh, you underestimate her. She doesn't want to just bonk me over the head when I'm not looking. What kind of fun would be in that? No, no, she wants to drag this out. Seduce me into complacency, and then when I least expect it. And that, my friend, is why we gotta get the hell out of here. Hmm. What? It's good to have the old Alex back.
Jimmy. What the hell happened? Ants. Little bastards ate my face. Uh, army ants. Aye. The devil's army. Ugh, look, I don't care what kind of ants they were. There were millions of them, dude. They were everywhere. I panicked. I totally panicked. Oh, well, that be how they work. They go for the eyes. Blind ye. Stumble once and you'd be dead. But for the counting. It's true. You can strip an animal to the bone in a matter of minutes. <sighs> great. That's great. I'll let it cross the river if you want to check it out. You trouble us for a matter of ants. Dude, he's trying to tell you something. These be not mere ants. This be the devil's army itself. Behold his handiwork. Easy. And what would you have us do? Abandon the harvest upon your council and scatter into the trees? I come only with warnings of what could be. Keep them to yourself. You be not the watcher anymore. Let not shame be your sport, Braylon. Ezra be my friend. He be not your father. was a prophet. Did you know that? Uh, yeah, I guess. Of course you do. You be the child of promise. I'm not the child of promise. No, you be wrong. You be favored. I can see it in your eyes. I be favored too. When I be grown, I be an elder. They saw it in my eyes. But I'm not as blessed as you. So what am I supposed to do? It's a child of promise. I know not. All I know is that you come, you lead us, and then you die. Come along, Amos. What kind of dung is this? Bat dung. What do you mean, there's bats in here? They trouble us not. This whole jungle's turning one giant petting zoo from hell. So let me get this straight. We come in, we clean the shelves so they can put food here. And then, uh, the bats just flying and crap all over the place, pretty much sum it up. Ezra? Come on, man, chin up. We told them, job done, all right? It's not our fault Balaam's an idiot. Balaam be an elder. You shall speak of him with respect. You gotta be kidding me. Ezra Balaam's a total goof. He be my son. Balaam's your son. Ezra, I didn't mean... Trouble not. Who would suppose an elder be spawned of a man like myself? A spreader of dumb. Ezra Dung's not that bad. Makes things grow. Flies swear by it. Aye. Dung has its merits. Let me show you one. To some, it is only the dung of the bat. Foul and useless. Then, but when mixed with a pinch of the powder of rotting egg. I don't like this job. <laughs> Almost. Jimmy. Oh, what do you want? Let's go find the ants. Why? You're out of your mind. It's okay. It's safe. They'd be black at night. 
Huh? Bivouac. The army ants, they, they have no permanent home. They're constantly on the move, so at night, they, they make a nest out of their own bodies. Can you imagine that? Solid mass of ants, four feet wide. You're not gonna let me get back to sleep, are you? Jimmy. Four feet wide. <sighs> army ants are the T-Rex of the ant world, Jimmy. Nothing can stand against them. Pure carnivore. Well, you are a fan. Dad bought me an ant farm for Christmas one year. You bet I'm a fan. I just think if he bought you a baseball glove, I'd be sleeping right now. This is it. This is where they were. <laughs>